In this video, we'll be doing mass to mole or mole to mass calculations. Our first example, we'll be looking at the conversion of 14 grams of water to moles of water. In order to do this, we'll first need to know the molar mass of water. So let's go ahead and calculate that. Hydrogen has a mass of 1.01. The subscript 2 tells me I'll need to multiply this value to get 2.02. .02. The mass contributed by oxygen will be 16.00 multiplied by 1. By adding the two together, I can calculate a molar mass of 18.02 grams per mole for water. Now, in order to set up my dimensional analysis to do this conversion, I'm going to start here with 14 grams of water. So I'm going to set that up here, 14 grams of H2O and then I'll do my dimensional analysis. I'll just put this over 1, and then I can see that I need to have grams of H2O here in order to make the units cancel. I'm trying to convert to moles of H2O, so I'll put that in the numerator of my fraction right here. And I just figured out the relationship. In every one mole of water, there are 18.02 grams of water. So by completing my calculation, I'll take 14 dividing by 18.02 grams to calculate an answer of 0.78. I'll report to two sig figs because the number 14 has two sig figs. This would be 0.78 moles of H2O. That's my final answer. In our next question, we're looking to convert 0.25 moles of carbon dioxide to grams of carbon dioxide. So once again, I'll need to determine the molar mass of this compound. Carbon has a mass of 12.01. That'll be multiplied by 1. Oxygen has a mass of 16.00. We'll multiply that by 2. 32.00. So we can see that the molar mass of carbon dioxide will be 44.01 grams per mole. So my dimensional analysis to do this conversion, I want to start out here with 0.25 moles CO2 and I'm going to convert from moles CO2 to grams CO2. So when I calculated molar mass, I found this relationship. Every one mole of CO2 has a mass of 44.01 grams. So I'll multiply 0.25 by 44.01 to find my solution. Once again, I'll report to two sig figs because 0.25 has two sig figs. So my answer here will be 11 grams of carbon dioxide. And I'll just put a box around my solution.